Hey guys, in today's video, I want to share with you guys the Siri Shortcuts application. I'm going to show you how to create your very own shortcuts and also share with you guys some of my favorite ones as well. Now, this application is for iOS 12. Apple bought the company Workflow and created Siri Shortcuts. This helps you get things done a lot faster. So it's something that would take three steps to get done. It will take only one step to get done, just one click. So therefore, the name Siri Shortcuts. You can download it from the App Store absolutely free, of course. And there's three ways that you can activate these shortcuts. You can use your voice with Siri. You can use home screen icon shortcuts, which is one of my favorites, or the widgets page right here. And you can simply tap, turn on or off. So let's begin. First, I wanna go ahead and share with you guys my personal favorite shortcuts. I have the widgets here for Siri shortcuts. I have Wi-Fi on or off, airplane mode. I have low power mode, take a picture, and take a video so those are my favorite widgets you can also use these with application shortcuts home screen and you can of course use your voice with siri to interact with these shortcuts or activate these shortcuts so let's go ahead and create a shortcut i was actually creating one here let me go ahead and delete the wi-fi on here select it and click delete so that i can show you how to create your very own but again links will be in the description if you want to go ahead and uh, share the ones or have the ones that i have here so why would I want Wi-Fi on or Wi-Fi off when I can simply just go to Control Center and turn it off? Well, there's many reasons for that. Number one, with a bigger device, it's hard to reach up there when you're using it one-handed. And not to mention, this doesn't really turn off Wi-Fi. It's just temporarily disconnected. So if you're leaving your house and you try to turn off Wi-Fi using Control Center, it's going to continue to look for other Wi-Fi networks. Number one, it drains the battery. Number two, it affects the experience because it interferes with the data and, and all that stuff. So it's just inconvenient. This really turns out off so if i click turn off and i go to settings it's really turned off let's go to settings here you see wi-fi is completely turned off when i do that from control center it isn't so let's create some of the shortcuts here and show you how this works so first thing you want to go ahead and create shortcut that's the first thing you want to do and then find what it is that you want to do so if i want wi-fi on all i have to do is search wi-fi and then right here set wi-fi click that Make sure that the toggle is turned off because that's the action that we want, Wi-Fi on. And then we want to tap on these uh, two icons here on the top right. Select the name for the shortcut. So this is going to be Wi-Fi on. Okay, there we go. So Wi-Fi on. And then we're going to go ahead and select an icon. I'm going to go with blue. And let's go ahead and search for the icon here for Wi-Fi. If I can find it. And there it is right here. Boom. So now we have the icon, we have the phrase, we have the name, and let's go ahead and select a custom phrase. So if we want to use our voice to activate this, Siri will understand. So Wi-Fi on. There we go. That's the custom phrase because we can activate it again using three ways, using Siri, our voice, the widgets, or the home screen shortcuts applications. One we have here is widgets. If you want to add it to the widget panel, you have show in share sheet. So I don't recommend using this one unless it's an action that you're going to be performing inside of an application. That's a little more in depth. And then create home screen shortcut, which is the applications, and then share the shortcut, which is what I'm going to do with you guys in the description with this one here and all the ones I have as well. So once we click done, the shortcut has been created, right? So all I have to do now is go back here let me go ahead and move it around, tap and hold, move it over here. And you'll see that the icon will be, or the shortcut will be right here on the widget. There it is. Wi-Fi on, Wi-Fi off, airplane mode, mute, take a video, take a picture. Things that usually take multiple steps only take one step with Siri shortcuts. Now, if I want to go ahead and delete this shortcut icon from the home screen, I can do that. And then go back to the Siri shortcuts application and show you how to add this back to the home screen. Just simply... Go ahead and uh, let's go ahead and tap here and add home screen shortcut. This is going to bring us here. And then we tap down here, create home screen shortcut, add to home screen, and boom, click add. And now we have the icon back on our home screen. We can bring it back here. And you see that now it's back in order. So there you guys have it. This is how you use Siri shortcuts. All my personal favorite shortcuts will be in the description if you want to use those. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. I'll see you on the next one. Peace.